Now to a predicament over the pipes in Folsom. Copper pipes all over the city are leaking. And nobody can figure out why. And the problem now involves more than 200 homes, and it's costing some of them thousands of dollars in repairs. CBS 13's Anna Giles is live in Folsom with this pipe puzzle. Anna. Yeah, guys, the city engineer is stumped on this one. The sheer quantity of homes experiencing these leaks. It's all over the city, leaving many neighbors to wonder who's next. It happened just hours ago at Mary Garrido's house. The tiny leak in a copper pipe. We had water dripping all through our garage. She's already seen others fall victim. I immediately yelled an expletive pinhole leak because I could, I just didn't, I knew immediately. For Mary, this just made a mess, but others are shelling out thousands in repairs. Even ceilings have caved in. There is no way to know or predict if it's going to happen again. The city is scrambling to figure out the issue. Engineers have discovered three trends about these leaks. They're happening on the cold water line on horizontal pipes and in homes built between 1980 and the early 2000s. A majority of the leaks as well have been like a one piece of pipe. Marcus Yasutaki with the Environmental and Water Resources Department says the city is having water quality analyzed and samples taken from the pipes affected. He says the water is safe and it meets state and federal standards. All the testing and all the sampling and all the results don't point towards any public health and safety concern. But neighbors like Mary are disturbed by what they can see. This is the exterior, and you can see the discoloration. A copper pipe mystery involving hundreds looking for the next clue. If there's already been that many leaks just in the last few days, something is accelerating this. Yeah, and as part of the city's study, study, they're also looking into how these pipes were installed, the workmanship. Now, there's a lot of eager residents here that really want answers. The city is hoping to have some by mid-September.